Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Health Forensics and we're here to look into this. Now, I've been researching capacitive filters on home electrical wiring that many people are installing and I installed this particular filter on Friday, it's now Monday and that has coincided with my partner showing some very unusual mental behaviours that she doesn't normally display. And we're going to take a look at what has happened with the magnetic fields in this room. And this is where my partner sleeps. So you can actually see that we actually have a 3 milligauss magnetic field in here. And I was quite surprised at how high the fields are in this room. So we're going to take a little look around with the meter and we're going to see what's going on with the fields in here. And I was quite surprised to actually find that in this particular room the fields have become very very high with the capacitive filter installed. And this matches some reports I've seen from people who say they've installed these capacitive filters and they got sick. So it appears that in this room there are very, very high magnetic fields being produced by that capacitor being connected onto the system. And this is the bed. So this is where my partner's head was. You can see that we've got very high magnetic fields in here. So we've got over 20 milligauss where the head goes. And it's right throughout the bed, it drops down a bit, but they say anything over two you should be wary of. So this whole bed is a little hot zone. Let's see what's going on on the other side. As you can see, as we get closer to the wall where the head would be, we get very high magnetic fields. And they drop off as you get further away from the wall. So let's repeat our test with the filter unplugged. And this is just a 47 microfarad capacitor. So it's now unplugged. Let's take a walk around the room and see what we get. So it's still in the same range. And we've got nothing. So I have a, a lot of these filters in the house right now testing capacitive filters. But I have to say this room is very, very unusual. The rooms that have these filters on are not displaying these high magnetic readings that this room is displaying. And it may well be a wiring error that is in this room. So I may have some more work to do on this particular room. As you can see, by unplugging the capacitor we got rid of the magnetic fields. And that was a very interesting finding. I hope you enjoyed the presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.